Okay, I've got a serious question. When was the last time Wargaming streamed? Looking at their website, going over here, we got two weeks ago, we can go live, stream two weeks ago, stream two weeks ago, and stream three weeks ago, stream three weeks ago, I uh, streamed a month ago, month ago, so this is four weeks, three weeks, where was last week's stream? Not to mention, over on Twitch, I'm kind of struggling to find... 21 days ago, which is a clip uh, streamed last year, highlights and uploads, uh, Winter Warriors, hello Minto, we miss you, um, all videos last year, okay, that's with Minto, um, did they just quit streaming on Twitch, and uh, what console's next stream will be on Tuesday, January 3rd, so today is Tuesday, January 3rd, I mean, don't get me wrong, it's... 3.31 a.m., uh, where I am, servers just barely went down, and then going over their Discord, guys, I haven't been on World of Tanks in a minute, like, in a big minute, oh, that light's blinding, I've actually been playing Mass Effect, I'm on my, uh, like, fourth playthrough on this character, um, and as you can see, I've been sitting here long enough reading over Discord and things and just kind of thinking to myself, wow, I should tap my controller. Oh, see, look, it lit up now. But Discord, would it be okay to show? Yeah, you know what? Screw it. I've been reading through this. The Turan got released. A ton of things got released. Um, one that I just read, which I think I just scrolled past. Tremendously. Hellcat. Sorry, I got distracted. Uh, yep. Um, so, I'm confused. Is he no longer an admin because of what he said? Or is he done? I, okay. Um, I'm not even worried about that. Whatever. I'll look at it later. But uh, the feedback on Tank Cup, you know what? Tank Cup was released. They talked about doing something really simple. And that was an exclusive giveaway of a tank. So, like, to whatever team participated, played, got their hands in the tank, they were the ones that got it. And right now, the negativity in feedback is nuts. We're talking like people just outright just trans back artillery 2.0, everything else. And I I don't disagree with them. Um on the day yeah, on the day that they um nerfed artillery. Um yeah, you guys can see. I, all right. Uh, Object 780 26 days ago. This is either the day of the update or the day after the update. Uh, I'm actually going to mute the in-game audio because it's going to be loud. And, yeah. Don't get me wrong, I know I was angled. I know that I kind of propped myself on the side of the wall. Watch it. 1,255 down to 18. I got hit for 1,217. Okay. And this was, after this match, that was my last match I played. Where we rebalanced artillery so they're not going to hit you for a thousand more consistently. Yet, my first day back, this is the only recording that I cared to record because um, this was my last match. After this, I was like, it, it's not even nerfed. Um, they didn't do anything about the penetration, and that was my problem. Not just that, they have more ample opportunity to shoot you. Because, well, yeah, that's what they got. They can shoot you more. They reload in 15 seconds. Who cares about the alpha? But, already can't be nerfed enough. Uh, those fake tanks need to be nerfed to the ground. I agree on this, and that was like 12-7. Okay. How far up inside this am I? 12-7. Let's go ahead and scroll down. This is surprisingly not a lot of feedback. At all. Like, this is... Literally, uh, less than three minutes of scrolling, and we're already back to the fourth. 
I mean, let's go ahead and click on this. Let's go down, go down, and just let's see how long this takes for it to hit the bottom. And I'm going to talk over it. This is ridiculous. There's a lot of people that have just outright quit the game, like me and Blade and a couple of others. And then they have all these greedy freaking um, things that they're adding into the game, which it's just continuously dropping in useless stuff immediately one after the other. It, it's useless. They're at, like, what was it? Um, the, the I, I stopped playing the game, 780 came out, and then, not to mention, they came out with the Torvong as a black tank, not even an unskinned version of the tank, and then the TL7, which was a TD that... Yeah, whatever. Don't care. Um, and they're both black tanks. Two brand new tanks of the game, and they're black tanks. And yeah, um, did you guys pay the outrageous amount that they were asking for them? Uh, I know I did. And I know I didn't even do a review on them after I bought them. So, yeah. Wow, that took less than 40 seconds to go through their suggestions over the course of the it's January 3rd of 2023. Hope you guys enjoyed your New Year's and Christmas, by the way. But this is ridiculous. Not to mention, go to the website. Uh, what's happening this week? January 9th. They're adding in the TVP 100. So we still don't have double barrels. We're still missing uh, quite a couple of tanks. They added in the... Yeah, they're just... Their roadmap is so messed up. I've never even looked at the roadmap, but I can tell you now. It's messed up. The Kong Pond's a medium tank. Yeah, whatever. It's got extra gun depression because of the way the turret's made. But, yeah. Um, I haven't streamed in, like, two months. I haven't. This is the first time I've recorded, and I'm recording just because of what I read. Going over their Discord and literally managing to go pack back an entire month of content in three minutes on just suggestions alone while beforehand it would take me like 10 minutes to go back an entire month originally um that just says how much the game that no one's playing not to mention making already you have to join his team period to get him to get a discount in the tank and not to mention i i believe on pc I believe on PC that Arnie is actually a tier 8. Iron Arnie tier 8. Let's go tier 10 now. Let's remove tier 8. Is it active? Tier 10? Tier 10? 10.8. Uh, remove 8. It's still... Uh, okay. Thank you. Uh, Lion... Uh, wow, they changed a couple of things in here, which is blue. Ah, collector tanks. Uh, I, I don't see it. I don't see it. Um, yet on console, uh, it's tier 10. Come here. Let's look at this. Um, 195. They made, I do believe on console, they made this like 330 millimeters. They, they made it a tier 10 on console. It's a tier 10. Rather than um, being a tier 8 like it was supposed to be. Um, so, I don't know what your guys' opinion is on that. But on my opinion, um, really? Oh, that's Germany. We need to go USA. Medium tanks. We're going to scroll all the way down. That was way too far. And then, Iron Artie. Now let's make it a tier 10 so we can increase the price of the tank by an absolute ridiculous amount. 9,100 on PC. Um, what was it? 22,500 on console, so $100 damn near. Let's increase the penetration from, you know, 268 to 330. You know, now let's go take a look at the uh, PC variant. Uh, penetration 230, not to mention it has heat rounds at 300 millimeters. This would have been an amazing tier 8 premium. 300 pin. With 320 damage and a 10.83 second reload. I, I'm looking at this, I would have been amazed to see this inside of tier 8. 
Instead, we get some makeshift garbage version that's upscaled, more additional armor, M47 Arnie. M47 Arnie. Okay. Tier 8. Oh, wow. That's great. 300 pin. Wow, that would have been amazing. 230 standard pin? That's enough pin to... Dude, 230 standard with a 105. Tier 10 105 at that. So it's really good. It, it's just... You have your tier 8 versions. You have your tier 10 versions. There's slight differences. The 230 pe penetration is that slight difference. So like a tier 10 105 is like... 232, 235 penetration on tier 8s. That's kind of how that works. Come here. Oh, wow. Uh, let's take a look at the tier. Oh, plays up to tier 10. Oh, okay. Plays up to tier 10. Where does it say it's a tier 10? Premium tank, USA. Oh, tier 10. Yeah. Let's upscale the price. Uh, speed wise, actually, you know what? Let's take a look at this. Let's go power to weight 16.95. Um,. 16.95. So technically, it is going to be the exact same tank as PC, just up armored, a little bit more damage, faster fire rate on the gun. And they took away something that would have been really cool to have at tier 8 from us. And I'm not even playing the game right now. I'm just on here to tell you guys I think this is stupid on what they did. Don't get me wrong, it's supposed to have really bad dispersion values at 0.42. Yeah, that's pretty bad. The console would have did 0.44, just like how they took the uh, Torvog and, and made it even worse than what it was in PC. In PC, it's horrid. 0.44 accuracy, and console did 0.46, plus increased its reload. I mean, we all remember what they did at a T-34. That thing got an amazing buff. But, yeah. Um, I cannot say with a straight face that the game is even worth considering to come back to. And I'm tired. I'm rotating the swing shift today from Graveyard. So, yeah. And I'm awake at 3... Yeah, 3.30 in the morning. I went and got some pizza because I was kind of hungry. And I'm fat. All right, leave me alone. But, you know what? Yeah, I can't say with a straight face that I'm impressed with what they're doing. If anything, it's kind of weird to have more money in the bank than I did prior by not playing it. <laughs> you guys, have fun. If you're still playing the game, let me know in the comments. Other than that, you don't even need to like this or anything else. It's just me being irritated by what I see and laughing at the fact that their Discord is dying and they're the ones that killed it. <sighs> Great.